Do you have a name yet? Yeah, it's Luke. Aw, that's a lovely name. Thanks, but what do you think we should call the baby? <laughs> Congratulations, you're the father of twins. That's odd, I work at the Minnesota Twins. Congratulations, you're the father of triplets. That's weird, I work for the 3M company. Congratulations, you're the father of quadruplets. That's strange, I work for the Four Seasons Hotel. <laughs> What's wrong? I work for 7up. Did you see my client commit this burglary? Yes, I clearly saw him stealing. This happened at night. Are you sure you saw my client commit this crime? Yes, I saw him do it. Listen, you're 80 years old and your eyesight's probably bad. How far can you see at night? I can see all the way to the moon. <gasps> Mom, look what I got on my report card. Oh, you got one A minus and the rest A pluses. I thought I raised you better. You should have studied harder. Look what I got on my report card. Who are you? Kuai Shan. Oh, yeah. What'd you get? I got all A pluses. Oh. Cool. Mommy, look what I got on my report card. Good job, honey. I'm so proud of you. You passed one class. Let's go for dinner to celebrate. Mom, do you think you could buy me a better folder to put my schoolwork in? This one's kind of falling apart. Well, it looks perfectly fine to me, but I'll go take a look to see if I have any old ones I could give to you. Mom, the teacher said today that we need to get something to um, write down notes in class. Hmm, I'm assuming she means like a notebook for you to write stuff down in. Well, you know what? Let's go get a MacBook. Mom, is it okay if two friends come over tonight since it's my birthday? No, I'm about to go to bed and I gotta wake up early, so I don't want a loud house tonight. Hey mom, I have a couple thousand people coming over tonight. Can you go get some games for us to play? Ooh, that sounds like fun. Of course, I'll also buy you guys some snacks while I'm at it. <laughs> mom, I'm doing my homework and I just have one quick question for you if you don't mind. Can you come over for a couple seconds? No, I'm gonna be busy the rest of the night. I'm sure the answer's in your textbook, just look harder. Mom, I just opened up my homework and it looks too hard. Here, how about this? If you give me your pencil, I'll let you go play some video games while I do your homework. Parents be like, go do your chores or I'm taking your phone. Then do it. Okay then. Hey, give it back, I'm just joking, come on, give it back. Hi, how are you doing today? I'm fine, thank you. Okay then, get out. Just wait, I got bit by a wolf. Where? No, just a regular one. <gasps> All right, sir, so my first question for you is, can you just tell me a little bit about your background? Yeah, of course. So um, my background is actually of Mount Everest. <laughs> That's it, I'm breaking up with you. You're way too addicted to gambling. What? Eh, you know what, it doesn't matter. I bet I can win you back. <laughs> Honey, did you eat the pizza that I was saving in the fridge? No, I ate it in the living room. Hello? Hi, I have a pepperoni bacon pizza with red peppers and pineapples. Um, I didn't order a pizza. This must be a mistake. No, it's not. Your neighbor forgot their Instagram password and wanted to share with you what they're having for supper. Excuse me, did I step on your shoe on the way to the bathroom? As a matter of fact, you did. Oh good, then this is my robe. <gasps> Hi, is this the stop taking things too literally course? Yes it is, please take a seat. All right, thanks. Sorry about that. <gasps> Luke, I'd like you to come do the dishes please. Why can't you just do them? Hey, watch it. Okay. Oh, well I'm Pennywise. <gasps> what? That girl that I liked that I was telling you about is walking up the stairs. Behind me? Yeah, but just don't make it obvious that you're looking. Ah, <gasps> oh, this is so annoying. What's with all the yelling in here? 
I'm trying to find a song that's been stuck in my head all day, and I searched up literally everything, but I can't find it. How does the song go? It goes like this. Yeah, 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 I know that one. You have? Do you know the name or who, who sings it? Unfortunately, I don't. What'd you search up? Here's what I searched. Hey, Mom? Yeah? Do you need any help? Oh, no, I'm good. Thanks for asking, though. Okay, I'm just gonna go watch some TV then. Ah, no one ever helps me clean this dang house. Hey, Luke, what are you doing in here? I'm just about to install these lights on the wall. Did I hear the word install? Yeah, I'm just putting up these lights. Let me grab my tools, I'll be right back. No, Dad, I don't need your help. All right, let's get started. Miss, can I go to the bathroom, please? No, not right now. What? Why not? Please, I really have to go. You have to wait until the last student gets back. Oh, I didn't realize what time it is. I better get going. Hey, can you give me my charger back, please? What percentage is your phone at? Um... So is the answer A or B? A. A. B. <laughs> How could you get that wrong? Actually, he's right. The answer is B. Seven more seconds, guys. Come on, push through. Keep that butt down, Alex. Good work, good work, guys. Come on, 19 more seconds. Good work, Luke. Great form. Hello? Yeah, I'll send him down. Luke? Your mom's here to pick you up for your dentist appointment. Hello? Hey, uh, how about Patrick Tui? Oh, yeah, that's me. Hey, teacher, how do I do this question? You should have listened properly. What did you say? You should have listened properly. <gasps> Can anyone tell me what the name of the cat was in this book? Oh, I know it, I know it, I know it. Luke? Maury. Sorry, what was that? Maury. Just one more time? Maury. Rory, yep, that's correct. All right, what other questions can I ask you guys? I was looking at you and you were looking at me and I was thinking. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Go to market. Go to market. Come on, Luke, you can do this. Mm hmm yeah. Oh, I know. Yeah, I know. It's, 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 it's cool. Who do you owe your success as a millionaire? I owe everything to my girlfriend. Wow, she must be a great girl. What were you before she came into your life? A billionaire. <laughs> Luke, what does IDK and IDC mean? I don't know, and... I don't care. Excuse me? Also, Mom, what's for dinner? I don't know, and I don't care. Mom, I'm gonna go to Jerry's house for a bit. Can you pick up milk? Yeah, that's easy. <sighs> no, I meant from the store. Oh. Well, I would imagine it weighs the same weight there, too. <laughs> what did you learn today at school? Apparently not enough. Why is that? Well, I have to go back tomorrow. Why are you crying? I'm playing. Pumpkin.
Hawkeye Impact the Third, and the storyline is so immersive I can't stop playing. And it's actually making me emotional. What game are you talking about? I need something new to play. Hawkeye Impact the Third. It's an ARPG game. How do I get it? Just click the link at the top of the comments and use code TRUTH63 in game for free items. Ah, this stupid computer's broken. Luke, can you help me? What's the problem? It says press F5, but it doesn't work. Okay, show me. Press F5. Mom, we're gonna be late for my soccer game. You know, your generation has no patience. When I was your age, if I was standing at the door like you are, my mom would be yelling at me that I'm not helping her with the dishes. Ah, come on, you stupid computer. I don't have all day. Mom, can we bring this cat home? No, son, we already have a cat at home. But it doesn't have a family. Did you say family? Mom? No, son, it's Don Toretto. Come on, let's bring it home. Why are you on your phone? Because this lesson's boring. While you're on there, text your mom and tell her I'll pick her up at 5. Looks like we're both picking up our girls at 5. Who's your girl? Your daughter. <gasps> You failed the test. Why didn't you study? Because there's 365 days in a year. After taking away 52 Sundays, there's only 313 days left. There's 50 days in the summer that are just way too hot to do any work, so that leaves us with 263 days. We sleep 8 hours a day, so that adds up to 122 days, and now we're left with 141 days. If we only spend one hour a day doing something fun, then that's 15 more days Quite gone, so now we're left with 126 days. We spend two hours a day eating, which is 30 days, so now we have 96 days left. We spend another hour talking to friends and family, which takes another 15 days away. So now there's only 81 days. Exams and tests take another 35 days a year, which means we're left with 46 days. If we take 40 days for holidays, then we're only left with six days. Now let's say you were sick for three days. Now you only have three days left, and two of those days you went out shopping. So now you're left with one day, but that one day is your birthday. No, I should get it because I always get 100% on my test, but I've never skipped a day of class. What are you two arguing about? We found this $20 bill and decided to give it to whoever could tell the biggest lie. You should be ashamed of yourselves. When I was your age, I didn't even know what a lie was. Ah, you win. <gasps> Kaden, how old is your father? He's 39 years old, miss. And Luke, how old is your father? He's the same age as me. That makes no sense. What are you talking about? He became a father when I was born. <gasps> I have a feeling that you are cheating on the test. What? Prove it. Well, the first question was who was the first president of the United States? The girl beside you put George Washington, and so did you. So, everyone knows he was the first president. Just wait a minute. The next question was who freed the slaves? The girl beside you put Abraham Lincoln, and so did you. Well, I read the textbook last night, and I remembered that. The next question was who was the president during the Louisiana Purchase? She put I don't know, and you put me neither. Ah! Hey Luke, what do you think you're doing? Class isn't the place to sleep. If class isn't the place to sleep, then home isn't the place to study. <gasps> Luke, your essay on my dog is the exact same as your sister's. Yeah, and? Did you just copy hers? No, we have the same dog. <gasps> is everything okay, Luke? Yeah. You know you could go play with the other kids, right? No, it's probably best if I stay here. Aw, why is that? Because I'm the goalie? Can you see God? No. Can you touch God? No. Then there isn't a God. Ma'am, can you see your brain? No. Can you touch your brain? No. Oh, so you don't have a brain? Luke, can you tell me how many seconds there are in a year? Uh, 12. 12? Are you sure? Yeah. January 2nd, February 2nd, March 2nd. So right here, we have a pretty simple question. 4 plus 4 equals 10. Actually, miss, that's not the right answer. Huh? 4 plus 4 equals 8, not 10. Oh, <laughs> I, I, I actually did that just to make sure you guys were paying attention. Okay, class, now I want you guys to discuss your answer with the person beside you. So, uh, wh what'd you get? Do you even know how to do this question? No. Me neither.
The first question is going to be pretty basic, just a few paying attention. But it's what is 5 plus 2? Luke? Hmm? Can you answer my question or are you not paying attention? Oh, uh, 7. No, you need to pay more attention. That is correct. <gasps> no, 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 I'm trying to read my book. Can I speak with you privately for a second? Yep, just one second. So I wanted to talk to you because you're failing this class. <laughs> you have a 37% and you're missing four assignments. Shh. How are the first two bites tasting, sir? Very good. That's good to hear. Is there anything I can help you with right now? Um, I think I'm good for now. Okay, enjoy. Actually, wait. How's it going, sir? Can you quickly get me a bookmark? <laughs> What's wrong? After all these years, you can't remember my name? What are you talking about? I just asked for a bookmark. My name's not Mark, it's Sam. <gasps> Mom, can I go to Jesse's for a sleepover? Yeah, it's been so long since I've talked to you. Mom? Yeah, sure. Can I take some money from your wallet for snacks? <laughs> That's too funny. Sure. Last thing, can I take your car? Yep, he's 17 now. Whatever. Where'd Luke go? He went to Jesse's house. What? And where'd my wallet go? He told me you said he could take it and the car keys. Where the heck are my AirPods? Aha! Nope, not here! Luke, I have a question. Hey, I know you took my AirPods. What? No, I didn't. Don't lie to me. I know you took them. Don't make me go. Oh. Dad, what does this say? Um, empty? Now what does it say? Empty. 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 What comes once a year, twice in a month, four times in a week, and six times in a day? Do you know the answer? Hmm. I don't know. <sighs> Let's try this again. Mom, can you give me $20? No, why don't you get a job and work for some money? If you give me $20, I'll tell you what Dad said to the maid when you were out shopping. Oh, fine, here's $20. Now, what did your father say to the maid? Hey, Mary, can you make sure I have a clean shirt for tomorrow? <gasps> Luke, what's 1 minus 1? 1 minus 1? Yeah, if you subtract 1 from 1, what do you get? 1. No, try again. Two? Okay, let's do it this way. If you have only one potato chip left in the frying pan and you take it out of the pan... Oh, I know the answer. You do? What is it then? Cooking oil. <gasps> can I go to the bathroom? I don't know. Can you? When I was using can, I was using it as a secondary model from a verbal modifier asking for permission opposed to expressing ability. But I thought since you were a teacher, you would know that. <gasps> Why are you on your phone? Because this lesson's boring. While you're on there, text your mom and tell her I'll pick her up at 5. Looks like we're both picking up our girls at 5. Who's your girl? Your daughter. <gasps> you failed the test. Why didn't you study? Because there's 365 days in a year. After taking away 52 Sundays, there's only 313 days left. There's 50 days in the summer that are just way too hot to do any work, so that leaves us with 263 days. We sleep 8 hours a day, so that adds up to 122 days, and now we're left with 141 days. If we only spend 1 hour a day doing something fun, then that's 15 more days gone, so now we're left with 126 days. We spend 2 hours a day eating, which is 30 days, so now we have 96 days left. We spend another hour talking to friends and family, which takes another 15 days away. So now there's only 81 days. Exams and tests take another 35 days a year, which means we're left with 46 days. If we take 40 days for holidays, then we're only left with six days. 
Now let's say you were sick for three days. Now you only have three days left and two of those days you went out shopping. So now you're left with one day, but that one day is your birthday. No, I should get it because I always get 100% on my test, but I've never skipped a day of class. What are you two arguing about? We found this $20 bill and decided to give it to whoever could tell the biggest lie. You should be ashamed of yourselves. When I was your age, I didn't even know what a lie was. Ah, <sighs> you win. <laughs> Kaden, how old is your father? He's 39 years old, miss. And Luke, how old is your father? He's the same age as me. That makes no sense. What are you talking about? He became a father when I was born. <gasps> I have a feeling that you are cheating on the test. What? Prove it. Well, the first question was who was the first president of the United States? The girl beside you put George Washington, and so did you. So, everyone knows he was the first president. Just wait a minute. The next question was who freed the slaves? The girl beside you put Abraham Lincoln, and so did you. Well, I read the textbook last night, and I remembered that. The next question was who was the president during the Louisiana Purchase? She put I don't know, and you put me neither. Do you think you're smart? Yeah, I'd say so. Oh yeah? Spell it. S. M-A-R-T I said spell it <gasps> Honey, why are you cooking more pancakes? We just finished eating them I'm making them for the dogs Why are you making them for the dogs? Because they don't know how to <gasps> Oh, okay, bye Jeez, that was quick Usually on there for hours I dialed the wrong number <gasps> Don't do it, I bet you'll regret it the rest of your life you dummy, don't say yes! No! No! Dang, he finally did it! What an idiot! What are you watching? Our wedding! <laughs> Look at my invisible car! Make this film yourself jumping over an object, then screenshot a part of the video where you're not in it and crop it so it's just the photo. Then open the Vita app on your phone and select new project. Choose the video you just filmed, then click on it and drag to where you want the video to start. Then press this button to make it the new beginning. Do the same thing with the end of the video but press this button. Then press the arrow on the bottom left, then press more and you should see a new effect called PIP. Select image on the top right and choose the screenshot. Then scale it to the same size as your video and also drag it to the start. Then find when you're jumping over the object and make the screenshot end there. Then press chroma key on the bottom, select the color of the sky, then adjust the intensity and you should get something that looks like this. Stand up. So you think you're stupid? No, I just felt bad that you were standing alone. <gasps> Vandaag gaan een goede dag wees. Wacht. Hoe kom prat ik hier die vreemde taal? Mama. Mama, alsjeblieft help. I brought you the same tool and I don't know how to do it. Honey, that's your soulmate's language. My soulmate's tool? Yes, and you'll only be able to speak English again once you meet him. Wonderlijk. Ek is geskroef. Hey, Giselle. Goeiemorgen, Jessica. Why are you speaking Afrikaans? Just need my school team. My soulmate brought you the tool. Girl, you're gonna struggle to find him. Yeah, that's what I would have thought. Come, let's go to class. Giselle, can you give me the answer to number seven? Um, yeah, I think I need to get it back. I'm afraid I don't understand. By the way, class, we're getting a new student today. He's an exchange student from South Africa, so please be nice. Giselle, can you give me the answer to number seven? Um, yeah, I think I need to get it I'm afraid I don't understand. By the way, class, we're getting a new student today. He's an exchange student from South Africa, so please be nice. 
Girl, did you see the new guy? Isn't he so cute? Yo, Kate. In Viti van Worf is hij? Ja, hij is van Zuid-Afrika. In wat protoland Zuid-Afrika? Ze spreken Afrikaans. Wait, dat betekent dat hij je... Ja, in ons eten winner. Giselle, dit betekent letterlijk dat de nieuwe kind je soulmate is. Ja, je hebt uiteindelijk twee keer met elkaar gezet. Je moet hem praten met hem. Is hij mal? Ik ga niet met hem praten, ik sta hier nog weer achter. Je moet hem eruit halen, want hij is op zijn weg hier. Hey, ehm, ik ben Michael. Giselle, dit betekent letterlijk dat de nieuwe kind je soulmate is. Ja, je hebt uiteindelijk twee keer met elkaar gezet. Je moet hem praten met hem. Is jij mal? Ik ga niet met hem praten, ik sta hier nog weer achter. Wel, je moet hem eruit halen, want hij is op zijn weg hier. Hey, I'm Michael. And you are? Oh, you can't speak? No, she can... No, apparently she can't. Girl, I can't believe you just did that. What anders moest ik doen? Ik sta bang om met hem te praat. Well, if you don't talk to him, you're never gonna be able to speak English again. Ja, ik weet. If you don't go talk to him today, I'm gonna tell him you were lying. Alright, alright. Ik sal met hem praat. Good choice. Hallo, um, jij hebt gezien je naam is Michael. Wait, you're speaking Afrikaans? That means you're my. Hallo, um, jij hebt gezien je naam is Michael. Wait, you're speaking Afrikaans. That must mean you're my. Jouw ziel is genoeg. Exactly, but why are you still speaking Afrikaans and I'm still speaking English? Nou dat jij dit noemt. Ja, dit is nogal vreemd. Ik wonder hoe kom praat ik nog steeds Afrikaans en jij nog steeds Engels. I don't know, but it's really weird. Ik ga gaan proberen uit te vinden. Jessica, kan ik gaan met jou praat? Yeah, girl, what's up? Oké, ik heb met Michael gepraat, maar ik praat nog steeds Afrikaans. Giselle, that just means he's not your soulmate. Wie anders is dit dan? Ik ken niemand anders wat Afrikaans is nie. Did you know that Michael has a brother? Wacht wat? Het hij een beauty? Yeah, I just met him this morning. Jessica, can I go with you prod? Yeah, girl, what's up? Okay, so I get with Michael to prod, but I prod not still Afrikaans. Giselle, that just means he's not your soulmate. Well, as the thing is, me, who is it then? I can't name any other but Afrikaans prod me. Well, did you know Michael has a brother? Wah, what? Is he a beauty? Yeah, I just met him this morning. Think it is like I. There's one way you could find out. Okay, where can I come cry? I think he's in the cafeteria. Okay, I come with him to talk. Giselle, there you are. I've been looking for you. Michael, hello. Um, seek out your booty. I come with him to talk. Why do you want to speak with my brother? I will not share with him. But I think your booty is talking with Sios tonight. That's impossible. It's me. Hey, I'm Jake. I'm Michael's brother. Hi, I'm Giselle. the dumbest kid in the world. Really? Why do you say that? Watch this. Hey kid, do you want one dollar or ten dollars? I'll take one dollar. What did I tell you? That kid never learns. Hey kid, can I ask you a question? Sure. Why did you take one dollar instead of ten dollars? Because the day I take the ten dollars, the game is over. Perfect. Let's see how they turned out. The heck? Ah! All the parking spots are full. What do we do? Why don't you ask this couple if they're leaving? Good idea. Hey, are you two going out? Oh, no. We're just friends. What is the secret of your success? Two words. And what are they? Right decisions. But how do you make right decisions? One word. And what is that? Experience. And how do you get that? Two words. And what are they? Wrong decisions. <laughs> the apartment!
Everything's on fire! What do we do? Quick, run to the balcony! Help us! Help us! Somebody help us! Maybe it would help if we yelled together. Good idea. Together! Together! What is your biggest fear? I'm terrified of heights. I avoid all tall buildings and even libraries. Why libraries? Because they have the most stories. So tell me, what's wrong with you? I'm just really afraid of the third letter, the ninth letter, and the fifteenth letter of the alphabet. Oh, I see. <laughs> Start writing this in your notes. Can I go to the bathroom? I don't know. Can you? So what did you need help with? I'm not gonna teach you this because you'll learn it next year. I'm gonna skip this because you guys should remember it from last year. Now before we move on, does anyone have any questions about anything we just went over? Yeah, I do. Can you just go over that final step one more time, please? Oh my gosh, were you not just listening? That's literally the last thing I went over. How do you have a question about that and nothing else? Oh, don't mind me. Just pretend like I'm not here. I just wanna listen in for a little bit. Oh, yeah, of course. So, uh, as, as I was saying, yeah, I could definitely go over that one more time for you, so. Mom, are you okay? You've been lying in here since you got home from work a few hours ago. You know what, honey? I'm not actually feeling that well. I have a bit of a headache. Oh, really? I think I might know why. Why do you think? It's because you're always on your phone. <laughs> you know that I, won't stop I need to tell you something. You what is it, babe? I broke your Xbox. You what? Just kidding, I cheated on you. So my Xbox is okay, right? A friend owes me $500, but he won't pay up. What should I do? Do you have any proof that he owes you the money? Nope. Okay, then send him a text asking for the 5,000 that he owes you, but it's only 500. Exactly, that's what he'll respond with, then you'll have your proof. Do you have $50 to lend me? I'll pay you back tomorrow. No, I don't. Sorry. Give me $50 right now. I just found $50. Here, bro. You can pay me back tomorrow. Do you think you're smart? Yeah, I'd say so. Oh, yeah? Spell it. S-M-A-R-T. I said spell it. Honey, why are you cooking more pancakes? We just finished eating them. I'm making them for the dogs. Why are you making them for the dogs? Because they don't know how to. Oh, okay. Bye. Jeez, that was quick. Usually on there for hours. I dialed the wrong number. Don't do it. I bet you'll regret it the rest of your life. You dummy, don't say yes. No, no. Dang, he finally did it. What an idiot. What are you watching? Our wedding. Look at my invisible car. Mom, did you change the Wi-Fi password? Oh, yeah, I did. The new password is 123456. Okay, thanks. It didn't work. Huh? What did you type? 123456. No, it's 123456. Go clean your room. No, it's my room. Well, it's my house. Then go clean it. No. I was just asking if I could- No. Hear me out, Mom. I just want- No. <sighs> no. Fine. Hey, didn't I ask you to clean the house today? Well, I tried asking you if you wanted me to clean the dishes, but you said no. Then I tried asking if you wanted me to back in the house, but you said no again. I even considered doing your laundry, but you just kept saying no. Oh. Can I please- Yes. Yes, you can. Okay. Thanks. I'm going out with my friends. I'll be back at 1 a.m. <laughs> All right, so this is going to be your workspace right here. And is that the fire alarm? Yes, it is. We better get out of here. Oh, and you know the drill, right? Yeah. Hi, it's nice to see you again. Yeah, same to you. Do you have a name yet? Yeah, it's Luke. Aw, that's a lovely name. Thanks, but what do you think we should call the baby? <laughs> Congratulations, you're the father of twins. That's odd, I work at the Minnesota Twins. Congratulations, you're the father of triplets. That's weird, I work for the 3M company. Congratulations, you're the father of quadruplets. That's strange, I work for the Four Seasons Hotel. 
Ugh. What's wrong? I work for 7-Up. Did you see my client commit this burglary? Yes, I clearly saw him stealing. This happened at night. Are you sure you saw my client commit this crime? Is everything okay? I had a really scary dream, and now my stomach hurts. What was it about? It was about me eating a really large marshmallow. A large marshmallow? <gasps> Luke, where's your pillow? What day is your birthday on? March 1st. Okay. So what day is your birthday? <gasps> Mom, am I handsome? Why don't you ask your girlfriend? I don't have a girlfriend. Well, there's your answer. I wonder what time it is. Well, it's not past 4 o'clock. How do you know? Because my mom told me I was to be home by 4. Do you mind if I take a picture? Yeah, go ahead. Alright, thanks. Mom, I won an iPhone in a race today. Really? Good job. How many people were there? Just me and two other people. Oh, not that many. Who are the other two? I don't really think you want to know. What? Tell me right now. The phone owner and the police. I want you. Honey, I love you so much. Aww, I love you too. One day, I'm gonna make you mine. And I can't wait for that day to happen. Remember a few years ago? I told you we were gonna do this. <sighs> yeah. Did you know you're the only one I've ever been with? No. Really? Yeah, all the others were nines or tens. <laughs> Honey, are you almost ready to go? We're gonna be late for our dinner reservation. Almost, I just need to put on some makeup. You don't need makeup. Aww, that's so nice of you to say. You need plastic surgery. <laughs> Honey, can you get me an iPhone for my birthday? But what about the other one? The other one's already getting me an iPad. <gasps> can I go down the water slide yet? Is that a yes or a no? Okay, I'm going. Hey, don't go until I tell you to! How's your meal tasting, sir? Can I speak to the manager, please? Of course, just one moment. I heard you wanted to speak to me? Yeah, I wanted to compliment you on your very clean kitchen. Clean kitchen? <laughs> Have you seen our kitchen? No, but it must be clean because all this food tastes like soap. <laughs> How did your meal taste, sir? You know what, can I just speak to the manager, please? Yes, of course, I'll go grab him. You wanted to speak with me? Yeah, hi, you must have a really clean kitchen. Have you seen our kitchen? Because all this food tastes like soap. <laughs> hey taxi, how much will it cost for you to drive me to the Super 8? Just $10. And how much for my bag? Oh, you don't have to pay for the bags. Okay, take my bag and I'll meet you there. <laughs> Doctor, I can't sleep at night. I keep seeing donkeys playing soccer. All right, I'm gonna give you some medicine and I want you to start using it tonight, okay? Can I start tomorrow? Why tomorrow? Because tonight's the finals. <laughs> Every time you smile, it makes me want to bring you to my place. Are you single? No, I'm a dentist. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? You can take whatever you want. I had a bad day. Okay, thanks. Wait, why are you letting me take things? So I have time to call the police. <laughs> I'm afraid you only have two weeks to live. What? No, that can't be true. Everyone get on the ground! This is a robbery! Now give me all your money! Okay, okay! Here, just please don't hurt me! Don't move! You're under arrest for armed robbery! I hereby sentence you to 20 years in prison. Yes! Alright, first question. 
Are you the killer? No. Are you sure? Yes. Killer say what? What? Ha! We got him! Guilty! I'm having problems with my hearing. Okay, can you describe the symptoms? Sorry, what was that? Can you describe the symptoms? Oh, um, March has blue hair and Homer likes donuts. <gasps> hey Luke, what do you think you're doing? Class isn't the place to sleep. If class isn't the place to sleep, then home isn't the place to study. <gasps> Luke, your essay on my dog is the exact same as your sister's. Yeah, and? Did you just copy hers? No, we have the same dog. <gasps> Is everything okay, Luke? Yeah? You know you could go play with the other kids, right? No, it's probably best if I stay here. Aw, why is that? Because I'm the goalie? <gasps> Can you see God? No. Can you touch God? No. Then there isn't a God. Ma'am, can you see your brain? No. Can you touch your brain? No. Oh, so you don't have a brain? <gasps> Luke, can you tell me how many seconds there are in a year? Um, uh, twelve. 12? Are you sure? Yeah! January 2nd, February 2nd, March 2nd... <gasps> so everyone would agree with me that we can't breathe underwater, right? What? You don't believe me? 